team, congratulations. Uh, it's been a great sprint, the win number nine in your career, the very first one in the World Tour. Yeah, it's also uh, my first, uh, I, my second uh, big race from one week. So, uh, yeah, um, but the last day I'm surfing a lot in the mountains. It wasn't easy, sure, after the crash the first day. So, uh, yeah, today was the last chance to uh, take a victory. So I'm happy uh, I can take the victory for the team and for myself. We saw that you kind of followed Gaviria, but tell us uh, how you outsprinted big champions like Ackerman and Nielsen in the end. Yeah, the uh, sport director says this morning you need to uh, go from far. So I uh, listened to him and uh, yeah, I make it off today. But it's uh, the perfect lead out from the team to bring me in perfect position. We take a rest to stay on the left side out of the wind. But uh, in the end, I make it off and uh, we, will, we make the right, uh, yeah, the right shows. You need to say something in Flemish for your fans in Belgium. Uh, allemaal uh, bedankt voor de steun laatste dag. En ik ben blij dat ik voor uh, in mijn nationale trui uh, nog eens kan winnen voor jullie. Simon, it's been your first day in blue. Uh, tomorrow there's a world climbing stage. Uh, the day after a time trial. Uh, which one do you think will be more decisive? Uh, will have a bigger impact on the GC? Uh... Your guess is as good as mine. Uh, tomorrow is a very challenging day. Um, I'm sure there'll be some action and some, some guys will try to take some time. Um, but we'll try and deal with it the best we can. And of course the time trial, yeah, everybody's alone. So it's, it's uh, only what you can do yourself. You're in a fantastic shape, a fantastic moment. But uh, who do you think of your opponents do you think you'll need to control more tomorrow? Uh, oh, tomorrow, I think the closest guys so are Rafael Maika. Uh, yeah, Gavin Thomas, of course. Um, but any, anybody there, you know, it's going to be a very hard stage, one that's hard to control. Um, so I'll try and recover today and, and hopefully we can defend the jersey. Pascal, after two stage wins, a second place today, uh, we saw you a little bit hidden in the last few uh, meters. What happened? No, I think I'm really happy about today because I had no lead out today and I had to go by my own and today I didn't find the gap, two days I found it and yeah, I think that cycling that you cannot win every time and I'm happy about my, my race today and also happy about the second place and now we have to see how I can support my, my GC guy Rafa and then we will see how the stage race will end for us. Thank you. Uh, auf Deutsch, um, du hast es versucht. Schade. Ja, ich denke, es war ein äh, super Rennen für mich. Äh, ich hatte heute leider kein Leadout, das hat ein bisschen gefehlt, deshalb kam ich von weit hinten. Ich habe die Lücke nicht gefunden, ich habe es oft versucht, ich musste oft bremsen und ich denke, ich kann halb happy sein mit meinem zweiten Platz und jetzt gucken wir nach vorne auf die nächsten zwei Tage. Hector, Green Jersey, you worked quite hard yesterday to get this jersey. Today you just controlled the, the race. Yes, uh, today at first was an easy race, but no, uh, Canola wanted to get it yesterday, but that will be fine tomorrow for sure. So do you have already a plan? Uh, looking forward to tomorrow's stage where we have four King of the Mountains? Yeah, I have to stay in the breakaway to get more points if it's possible. If it's not, uh, leave the breakaway without second in the general classification. Última pregunta en español para tus aficionados. Uh, ¿Esa camiseta verde era un objetivo primario de tu equipo desde un principio? No, eh, veníamos con la intención de hacerlo lo mejor posible, pero bueno, eh, gracias a la fuga pude conseguir los puntos y ya que estamos aquí hay que ir a por todas.